This is the stuff you'll be needing. A roll of string and you, if you have scissors you could cut it off the roll or if you just already have one. Stapler and a piece of ripped off square paper. So the way you make it is you take your paper, fold it down like that and then take it again and fold it down. So like that. Then fold it again like that. And fold the last one like that. Not a square. Triangle. And if you think you need to fix like the angle of the triangle like on one side, then you could do that because see how mine this one's like longer, this one's up and shorter, so So, so I'm just going to fold it back again because I messed up. So I kind of unfolded it. So, so then you have your kite. Then you're going to want to take your string. Make sure the part you cut, if it's messed up, make sure you put that part on the back. This part's messed up. So, I'm going to, this one's messed up more. So, you're going to want to, but first you're going to want to, like, push them all down make sure the creases are all good. Then you're going to want to take it right there. Hold it right there. And you're going to want to take your stapler, but make sure it's on the triangle part. And you're going to want to staple it. And so it's like that. And then you're going to want to have your babies, or you decorate it. But I'm going to actually staple the bottom more. Because it's wiggly, so there. Now you have your kite, and it will blow in the wind, but there's no wind, so there's a fan, but... Not strong enough. So you have your kite for your baby. Then you're going to want to make a loop. Like that. It's not going to fly that high, but make a loop so they could hold it. Make it sure it could fit any like baby size hand. Really? And then staple it like that. Come on, guys. If you want, you could lift it up so it's easier. Um, oh, it didn't work. So you don't want to make a loop for any size baby hands so they could hold it. Sounds like I don't think I can make it a perfect size for Tyler, but for Tyler to use it. The kids also have a little frisbee, so why won't this work? You want to make sure you do it on a good surface. So, yeah. almost perfectly so I have to fix that and you might want to do it sideways because it might come off so oops my staple came out so that's how I did it. And if you want, you could use pliers or scissors and cut the extra bit of the staple off. Oh, because it just came off. I don't know where that went. I'm just going to take that staple off because I already have one on there. I'm going to, when you do it, 
when you do it, you're going to want to do it sideways like that. And then do it again on the other side. So That's what I'm doing. So Oh, it didn't. You, if you don't want to make a hole, you don't have to, you don't want, if you don't want to make a handle, you don't have to. But I'm going to try to use glue stick. I think you might need a glue stick to use. So, just use a glue stick instead. So then it would be, it would work. Don't think it's put any glue on it. it. Won't like my glue stick won't glue anymore, which is weird. It feels like hard on this side. Oh, cause it's coming out. Oh my gosh. That's why. So you just take if that happens, so just take a piece of your glue out with your finger and do it like that big. And then you'll be good. And then you just let it dry. And that's how you make a kite for your baby. And then they would have, and your babies will have so much fun with it. Um, and I think all of them will like it besides probably Tyler because <laughs> it's probably too small for his hand. And he's more like a kite. He's more like a frisbee guy, so. I'm actually make this bigger. Oh, or I just put it in the same place. So that's how you make a um, little baby's kite. So then you just have to let it dry for like an, maybe a half hour or maybe an hour or a day. If you want to use it today, then you probably will have to use it in a half hour to do it. Oh. Please subscribe for notifications. Give us a big thumbs up. Hope you have a great day. Bye.